Oyster Shell Calcium 500 mg, 1250 mg, tablet is used to prevent or treat low blood calcium levels in people who do not get enough calcium from their diets. It may also be used to treat conditions caused by low calcium levels such as bone loss, osteoporosis, weak bones, osteomalacia slash rickets, decreased activity of the parathyroid gland, hypoparathyroidism, and a certain muscle disease, latent tetany. This medication is also used in certain patients to ensure they are getting enough calcium, such as women who are pregnant, nursing, or postmenopausal, and people taking certain medications such as phenytoin, phenobarbital, or prednisone. Calcium is essential for the normal functioning of nerves, cells, muscles, and bones, and having the right amount of calcium is important for building and maintaining strong bones. It is important to take the daily dosage as prescribed by your healthcare provider, and the best time to take this medication may vary depending on your individual needs. When taking oyster shell calcium 500 mg, 1250 mg, tablet, it's important to take it with food. If your product contains calcium citrate, you can take it with or without food. Make sure to follow the directions on the product package or as directed by your doctor. For best absorption, if your daily dose is more than 600 mg, then divide your dose and take it throughout the day. If you're using the chewable product, be sure to chew it well before swallowing. And if you're using the effervescent tablet, let it fully dissolve in a glass of water before drinking it. Don't chew or swallow the tablet whole. If you're using the liquid product or powder, be sure to measure the medication with a dose measuring spoon or device to make sure you get the correct dose. Do not use a household spoon. And if the liquid product is a suspension, shake the bottle well before each dose. It's important to use this medication regularly to get the most benefit from it. Try to take it at the same times each day to help you remember. If your doctor has recommended a special diet, be sure to follow it to get the most benefit from this medication and to prevent serious side effects. And don't take other supplements slash vitamins unless ordered by your doctor. And if you think you may have a serious medical problem, be sure to get medical help right away. If you experience constipation or an upset stomach while taking oyster shell calcium 500 mg, 1250 mg tablet, it's important to let your doctor or pharmacist know. However, many people using this medication do not experience serious side effects. It's important to talk to your doctor if you notice any serious side effects, such as nausea slash vomiting, loss of appetite, unusual weight loss, mental slash mood changes, bone slash muscle pain, headache, increased thirst slash urination, weakness, or unusual tiredness. While a serious allergic reaction to this drug is rare, it's important to seek medical help immediately if you experience symptoms such as rash, itching slash swelling, especially of the face slash tongue slash throat, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. It's important to note that this is not a complete list of possible side effects, so if you notice any other effects, it's best to contact your doctor or pharmacist. If you are in the US, you can report side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or at www.fda.gov slash medwatch. In Canada, you can report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. Before taking oyster shell calcium 500 mg, 1250 mg, tablet, make sure to speak to your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies. This product may contain inactive ingredients that could cause allergic reactions or other problems. It's important to consult your pharmacist for more details. If you have high calcium levels, kidney disease, little or no stomach acid, heart disease, pancreas disease, certain lung disease, or difficulties absorbing nutrition from food, it's important to consult your doctor or pharmacist before using this product. Some sugar-free formulations of calcium may contain aspartame. If you have phenylketonuria, PKU, or any other condition that requires you to restrict your intake of aspartame, it's important to consult your doctor or pharmacist about using this drug safely. If you are pregnant or breastfeeding, be sure to consult your doctor before using this medication. It's important to be aware of potential interactions with other medications when taking oyster shell calcium 500 mg, 1250 mg tablet. Some products that may interact with this drug are digoxin, cellulose sodium phosphate, and certain phosphate binders such as calcium acetate. 
Calcium can also decrease the absorption of other drugs such as bisphosphonates, tetracycline antibiotics, estromostine, levothyroxine, and quinolone antibiotics. It's recommended to separate your doses of these medications as far as possible from your doses of calcium. Always check the labels on all your prescription and non-prescription slash herbal products, as they may contain calcium, and ask your pharmacist about using those products safely. Remember to keep a list of all the products you use and share it with your doctor and pharmacist to ensure your safety and well-being. If someone has taken too much oyster shell calcium 500 mg, 1250 mg, tablet and is experiencing severe symptoms like passing out or difficulty breathing, it's important to call for emergency help right away. In the US, you can call your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222, and in Canada, you can call a provincial poison control center. Symptoms of overdose may include nausea and vomiting, loss of appetite, changes in mental or mood, headache, weakness, and tiredness. Calcium is an important mineral for our body, and it can be found in dairy products, dark green leafy vegetables, and calcium-fortified foods. Vitamin D helps with the absorption of calcium and can be found in fortified dairy products, eggs, sardines, cod liver oil, chicken livers, and fatty fish. It can also be produced by our bodies when we are exposed to the sun. When taking oyster shell calcium 500 mg, 1250 mg, tablet, it is important to have regular medical tests to check your calcium levels. It's important to keep all medical and lab appointments and consult your doctor for more details. The recommended daily dosage of oyster shell calcium 500 mg, 1250 mg, tablet varies depending on your age, gender, and specific health condition. It is best to take this medication with food to help with absorption. Always follow your doctor's instructions for the best timing to take this medication. If you forget to take a dose, take it as soon as you remember. If it's close to the time for your next dose, just skip the missed dose. Take your next dose at the usual time. Do not take a double dose to make up for the missed one. It's important to store oyster shell calcium 500 mg, 1250 mg, tablet at room temperature, away from light and moisture. Make sure to keep it out of the bathroom and away from children and pets. When it comes to getting rid of this medication, it's important not to flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless instructed to do so. Instead, properly discard the product when it's expired or no longer needed. You can consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for guidance on how to do this. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA. 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.